Uh, hi, this is Daniel. And Jessica. Uh, from UK Haunters. We are here to cover um, Broadwich Farms Hornfest. It is pissing down with rain. It's pissing down with rain. Which, to me, I think just adds to the atmosphere. It does. Um, so we're going to have a look around, uh, give you own some reactions. And then later on, we're going to go and, oh, beetle juice. Uh, we're going to have the proper one break down with um, our man at Scare Track, Mikey. Yeah, uh, what until... he means by proper one is we will talk about this on the podcast, the Scare Track podcast. And that's why she gets paid a big bucks. That's the day! Last week come say my. Cause you know, darling, she's leaving. Hi, glad to be the most beautiful, stunning, goddamn bitch around. How can I help? Oh, me? Oh, darling, just give me a rich man and I'll kill him myself. Take the money like I've done before. Mwah. Right, first one is Spooky Castle. The um, OG house here. Yeah, the original house, and if you've seen the UK Hornets Haul- Haul- documentary, it's probably illegal because it's not released yet. Um, but when you see it, you'll realise how this house and why this house is so important. So I was going to go through it. And why I don't want to go back through it. Um, exactly, <laughs> and uh, then we shall let you know our fins on the other side. Right, so we have just been through Spooky Castle, and that was absolutely terrifying. Fucking terrifying. Um, I'm hot and sweaty and scared. And of course, um, as I said, we can't really go through this too much detail because that's really reserved for the podcast. Um, but what I did like is one of the buggers made me jump and then remembered what I said when he made me jump. It made me jump two rooms later by saying the same thing. The same thing. So, fuck mine! And he jumps out and went, fuck mine! Like, two rooms later. And I thought that was actually genius. Um, the Speed Castle is the original um, haunt. The first we one don't want to spoil it. Being the original, we're not going to show anything yeah. of the Spooky Castle purely because... It's the original, and we want yeah. you to come and visit them. But it, it was it was amazing. So yes. yeah, we'll go back to more podcast, and we're now off to our next one. Alright, scare track, hopefully this one is recording. And this is Mass Acre. It's very wet. It is very wet. Well, hello! How y'all doing on these fine evenings? Anybody's feeling hungry? It depends, what's on the menu? What have we got tonight? Linda. <laughs> I'm like Linda. I'm veggie, I'm afraid. Oh, you fuckers! What? Oh. Jesus. I just lost a stone. Is that another Linda? Oh, this is his vial. So we are at Mass Acre, uh, you can hear the chainsaws in the background. Um, last year was one of my favourites, I do love yep. the corn maze. Um, the fact it's pissing down with rain is actually quite helpful, it adds, adds to it. Um, if you could just... You may have missed them, but they just ran out screaming. screaming. So I, um, th- I think the interesting thing about this maze is that every year they grow the crops. Yeah. And, and redesign the maze so that each time you've got a different... <laughs> Don't show that bit, Mikey. Don't show that bit. I do. Uh, That's my favourite so far. That is, uh, I, I, I still like the original man, I like Speed Castle is my favourite. Uh, the fact that it's really crappy weather really worked for this one. Yeah, especially yeah. In the, you're, you're walking underneath the, sort of the, the slats of wood and the bits of metal and all of that is amazing. And, and the wet ground as well. Shut up, we don't it's care about it. you! <laughs> what is this? What are you doing here? Hello, sweetie. 
Don't touch him, Pearl. Give me, I'm allowed to touch him. What is it? Who did you say? Who did you say we were? Alright, we're back again. We've got them all from the background, and we are at. Uh, this uh, uh, fucked you up last time. Yeah, last when... I came out shaking, and the scare actors are amazing in this last year, and I hope they're just as good this year. Um... I'm, I'm keeping an eye out for Lizard and Beast with you, so yeah, after no, our no, last encounter. Like yeah, Jess said she gets free shit, to which point he smiled and said, I'll give you free shit. And, and tried to drag me off. Yeah. Um, so I'm glad we're away from yeah. it now. And going out the frying pan into the proverbial fire, and we should let you know what it's like when we get out. We have our man, Mr. John Harris here. Um, <laughs> good, good, good interview, really. Yeah, well so, uh, how's it been so far this year? Second yeah, day. Yeah, I mean, it's only the second day of the run, but um, apart from the weather, it, yeah, I'm really pleased the way it's been. Yeah? Really yeah, yeah, I mean, the actors are on point, you know, it's, it's, it's good stuff. Really good stuff. Um, what is the best quote you've heard from Scared Person so far? I beat myself! <laughs> <laughs> the, the standard, I mean, come on. And there's so many of them are doing it, which is great. Right, and, it right. and it won't show tonight, will it? <laughs> <laughs> cool, thank you. Uh, See you later. <laughs> Right, we are here. We have found some waste and space. This way, thank you. Hello. Beetlejuice. Uh, excuse me, who, who am I? Licking people too, the weirdo. <laughs> Look at and this lovely so lady. Nice. We got married earlier. We did. Say hello to her. It's official. Hello. My name is Jessica. I love Beetlejuice so much. <laughs> Jessica, please. You're making me blush. You're making me blush. <laughs> so we've just done the edge, which is our fourth and final haul. Again, yeah. because a certain pair of pussy holes won't do. Um, the yeah, at least we, at least we own it. At we're least like, we own it, yeah, yeah we own we're it. owning it. Not, not, not for the touching. Not for the, no. after, after the Beetlejuice Lydia touching. Yeah, thing. the Beetlejuice fucked um, me up then. Yeah, after that, I don't think we, we need any more touching for now. We're going to get touched again. I can feel it. Out of the corner of my eyes, I'm seeing it. others. How can I, darling? I can go. feel it as well. Hi, darling. Mwah. So, we've just come out of the edge. Yeah. I really like it. it it's got A lot more religious of, themes. It's very religious, very demonic. Very also vampire coffins. There's a bit in it, I don't know if it's intentional, I hope it's intentional, where the guy is like, you're in Hell's Kitchen and it's like crispy and it smells like bacon y. Girlfriend, please, of course, is it? Intentional. No, I don't know. There's a food cart behind that selling it, something that it, I need. No, it's, it's intentional. This is Roddy's farm. Everything's intentional. Um, yeah, so that's, we're going to have a look around and then we're going to do the wrap up. Yeah. So we've done all the haunts now. Yeah, the night's drawings were closed. Um, we didn't end up doing, even though Dracula talked us into it, it was apparently too grabby and yeah. man, they're just too good at terrifying us. We they just, are. We, we wussed out on the fifth and final house. We've got someone dancing in the background. Yeah. You can dance, it's, it's going on the internet. Why are you scared? <laughs> this is for a docu-series, does it scare you? Yeah. Which ones have you done? Um, all of them except the ones they grab your legs. See? I'm not See? the only one! They so, didn't do they, it They either. didn't do the grabby leg ones, so we're now justified in not doing the grabby leg ones. See, it's not just us. Yeah, so, um, which one you thought was Sarah? The clown one. The clown one. I think, like, you know when it's closed? Yeah. Oh, 13 freaks. 13 freaks, yeah. I would recommend it. Are you local? Whole night? Or did you travel over here? We're local. Okay. Would you travel if you weren't local? There you go, Londoners. Come down. Jess, I'm being molested again. I can't. I can't remember how you made this sweet tea. I can't go in. Can I go in? Can I go in? Oh dear, what have you done? So, we are back from Brodish Farm. Yep. Um, it was fucking awesome. It was brilliant. As Brodish Farm always is. Yep. Um, what are our highlights? 
Definitely Beetlejuice and Lydia. Okay. Those scare actors were amazing. They were absolutely fucking fantastic. I'd like to say win point for me is you know you're doing well when you manage to gross out a scare actor so much they break character. He ate a cookie which she had already chewed. Well, let's not flirt this up too much. She licked it. But yeah, broke character, so yeah. win. Um, Favourite quote tonight was a girl being chased by a clown screaming, please stop, I need a pee. No, mine was the woman that screamed, I've already fallen on my ass today. So. Um, Favourite scare? Um, the one where the guy scared me, then ran ahead of me and then used what I said in my reaction to being scared to scare me again. I thought that was pretty, pretty fucking meta, really. Yeah, yeah. quite impressive. Uh, Favourite scare for me was we was filming a introduction to one of the mazes and the scare had to come behind me and scream in my face. Oh, in my true. ear and it scared me. That's true. That got me good. So if you like what you've seen here today on this little clip, um, please follow Scare Track. Actually, you'll be following Scare Track anyway because it's been their channel. Well, Follow we need UK to say thank you for the scare track for letting no, us... No, no, scare track needs to say thank you for us for being fucking awesome. I think I knew that anyway. Yeah. But, anyway. Um, but make sure to tune into the podcast. We'll yep. be discussing um, this in uh, much more detail with, yeah. um, with Mikey. P.S. Happy Halloween. <laughs>